<laughs> okay, starting over. Danielle of Alex Diamonds. Andre of Alex Lexington. And now that gold is at it, has it reached an all new high? No. No. We've been, we've hit two thousand before. It's yeah, just been a while. They're calling like a such and such week high. It's it's up there though. We're we're, we're on the brink of um, two thousand dollars an ounce. It hit two thousand dollars an ounce last night in the overseas. Okay, so we've hit two thousand dollars an ounce. That's significant, especially for people that. But in the nineties, it was two fifty. So it's ten x. Yeah. In twenty years. Give or take. Dad is like, why is gold two thousand dollars an ounce? Well, we got in gold was a thousand nine hundred to a thousand dollars an ounce. When, yeah. when, when when we got in the business, two thousand ten, two thousand nine. Eh, give or take. Give or take. Somewhere in there. So, talk to me. The phone has been ringing. People have been saying, "Run to gold," which for the past how long everybody's talked about. No. Don't put your money in gold. That's a bad investment. But it's good enough for everybody to run to when things get bad. Well, I think what you have is when things happen, like what happened in at SVB, was it last week, the week before? Yeah. It started the week before last. Correct. People start getting scared. Mm -hmm. And then now they're running to solid things because you find out that all of these things that you're investing Unleveraged in, things. Are over the things you're, you've been dealing with are overly leveraged. Mm -hmm. and, and if you don't know what that is, you don't have it, and you're still selling it. That's a short version, but yeah. And metal is metal. So long as you're actually buying metal, then that goes back to what we sell. Right. And people call, send an email. Set up a consult appointment. Everyone's situation is different. So we create a strategy based on your situation. I can't tell you what to do, what not to do, because everyone's situation is different. Like a wealth manager. Right. Okay. We're not wealth managers or wealth advisors. We are. These are speculative products. I think we have to give that disclaimer. It, it's all based on speculation, but a lot less speculative than what's out there right now. To say the least, yeah. So what we tell clients is people that call, email, fill out a form so we can best suit your needs. Come in or we video because we have customers that are not in um, our state or in our area and set up a consult. Yeah. And we'll see what you need, what your wants and your needs are and how we can facilitate those. Oh. What's the, one of the number one questions we have right now to newcomers? Why don't you have it today? I think that's the number one question. What do you have in stock today? And because of what's happened in the last week, everything is on back order. Well, not everything. A lot, A of, product. lot of product is on back order because everybody's fault basically was emptied because... Orders have been. If you weren't paying attention to the financial markets, the people that that heard first ran to shore up themselves as best they can. Right. So. And gold and silver are solid assets. It's like buy, almost like buying real estate. Just it moves easier. A lot easier than real estate. Yeah. A lot faster. So. Why don't we have it in stock? Nobody. Well, I wouldn't say nobody has anything in stock. Most. I'm sorry. There are dealers. We're local. We're hybrid. We're the hybrid between a local dealer and a national service provider like your other online vendors. Our prices are live. Our inventory is based on what's available within a certain time period of delivery. Most local coin shops don't um, have access to some of the suppliers that we have. They would, they have to order it from someone. We're ordering it from someone, but everybody doesn't do it the same way. Everybody so, who is not a mint is ordering from someone. Really? Let's be real. Okay. We're not a mint. You have to get it from somewhere. 
And we don't make it in the back. Even the, well, the people we buy from don't make it in the back. They have to order it from somewhere. Correct. Except the people we we deal with don't deal with them. Does do not deal with the public. Correct. So I think that sums up. Right. And nobody's going to the U.S. Mint and say, "Hey, I want some gold eagles." It don't work, work that, that way. way. It just doesn't. Anything else that a person intrigued should know? I don't think so. All right. Well, hopefully we were able to answer some of your questions, concerns. Call Alex Lexington. Go to alexlexington.com. The Alex Lexington Network has some education if you're looking for education. I think, oh, I'd be shameful if I didn't um, plug. For those of you that have already been investing in precious metals and are looking to liquidate and want to indulge yourself a little bit, Danielle of Alex Diamonds, if you're looking to do some custom jewelry and uh, create a jewelry piece, springtime is coming. People come out, jewelry comes out. Blinging in the sun. Yeah. Thank you. Have a great day. See you soon.